Hi everyone, how are you? I hope you're having a really good day today. My name is Marina and today's video is going to be a video on this Ted Baker London Brilliance of Beauty set which I purchased, well I received as a gift at Christmas and I'm sure many of you did and I know it's really late to be doing this but I'm just going to give you an overview of what is in here and give you some swatches and let you know what the products are like if I have tried them. Make sure you watch in HD and let's get on with the video. So the sleeve actually comes off of the box and then the box looks like so. So it's white with these beautiful flowers on around the sides and then it has got a flip up thing and a little mirror and then a pull out drawer here. So I'm going to start with the top. The top. So firstly you get this, what is this called, Ted Baker thing. The packaging is really pretty and this is like a blusher highlight duo type thing so it's like this and then you can pull it and twist it Whee! but just don't dig the mirror in but it's got a nice decent mirror which is good and then here you get a blush a highlight and another blusher so I'm gonna swatch these for you that is the darkest blush That is the highlighter, which is really pretty, quite chalky. And then this is the lightest blush, which to be honest with you, I don't even know why why they have that there. Because you can barely see it. So that's the dark blush, the highlighter, and the light blush, which you can't even see. These two are really pretty, but I won't be using that. These two are really pigmented, this one you can't even see. Um, they are quite chalky but what can you do? Next up we have got a kabuki brush. It's got a really nice gold handle and then brown bristles and this feels really, really soft. It's not very dense though so I don't know, it might work for packing powder on but it seems really soft. I haven't actually used this yet. I used the, the, um, the blush and the highlight before, not today, but it lasted quite well. Next along we have got a cream blusher. I really like the packaging, it's white with this gold lid and then you pull the lid off and here is the product and that is how much you get so you don't get too much but it's like pink with gold sparkles in and that's actually really pigmented so I haven't actually used this because I only really use cream blush in the summer but that looks really pretty and also I think that will make a really nice lip colour as well. Next we have got a lipstick, again it's the white packaging with the gold writing, it's got a gold T there and then this um, nice gold tubing and this is just a nice nude and I'm going to swatch this. So it is a really pretty nude, I wore this. Um, previously and uh, it's not that flattering on me I think this would suit someone fairer but it is still pretty and then we have got a lip gloss again I love this packaging um, and it's just a standard doe for applicator wow this is really pigmented oh and it smells really nice it smells like really sweet they're so pigmented. I think this is going to be like a lip cream rather than a gloss because that is super pigmented like pow. It smells really, really nice as well. I am intrigued to see how it will dry so I'm just going to leave it there for a bit. So that was everything in the tray. Now I'm going to move on to the drawer. So you get a set of eyelash colours. These are okay. They feel quite flimsy and like this doesn't stay it kind of flips everywhere so it's not not the best and like I don't know I just it's a bit cheap to be honest with you then you get two nail polishes and these don't have names but they have white lids and then they have got the gold tea on top and you get a nice peachy nude 
This would be really good for French manicure. And then you get this kind of grey taupe colour, which I probably won't use, so I'm going to put this in my giveaway. Um, so make sure you watch my giveaway video, that's going to be up before this, but you will be getting this as well. Um, but yeah, this one looks really nice. I haven't actually tried these, I might do a quick swatch. So it's a standard brush. Oh yeah, this is like totally clear. Totally clear. But that would be nice for French manicure, so I'm going to keep that. You get an eye brush here. Um, it's got kind of a pinky, pinky tone to it. And then this is the, the brush. So that would be really good for packing colour on and it feels really soft. So I can't wait to use that. You get a mascara, which is just all white packaging. Um, I did use this before. Um, it's a very weird brush to be honest with you. It's got plastic bristles um, and it's okay, it's not the best, uh, but it will be good for layering I think, but it's alright. Then you get a, I think this is a felt tip eyeliner. Wow, that's really black. That looks really good, so I'm excited to use this. I love felt tip eyeliners. And then the final item you get is um, some eyeshadow. I think it's a trio. Yeah, it's a trio. So that's what the packaging looks like. You get a nice, decent sized mirror, and then these are, oh, please excuse my nails, these are the colours. So they're really pretty. So I'm going to swatch it. So that's the first one, really nice. I am rubbing quite hard in these just so I can definitely get a good colour payoff. Okay, so they're actually really pretty colours but I don't think they're that pigmented because I did have to dig my finger in. But that is them. So that was everything you got. I just wanted to do this video just to show you because in case I do another one next year then you might want to buy it if it's got similar items in. So to be honest they're not the best but they're not awful either. So if you are buying for someone who's a beginner at makeup or a child who just wants to mess around or a teenager then I think it's a perfect gift. So that's it really, I hope you enjoyed and if you did please give it a like and don't forget to subscribe. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! It looks like so, I haven't, I think I've only used this one once so far. Stunning, this one will be especially good for darker skin tones. So that's that one. And then my favourite 